On March 8, 1996, the third Taiwan crisis commenced, and Chinese missiles began landing seriously close to Taiwan. The U.S. president authorized the U.S. Navy to respond on the exact same day. A Ticonderoga-class cruiser was based off the southern coast of Taiwan, where American forces were already present. As they made their way back to Japan from the Philippines, the aircraft carrier USS Independence CV-62 and her carrier Group 5 positioned themselves on the eastern side of the island. Following the missile tests, the USS Nimitz, operating in the Persian Gulf, was given the order to steam into the Western Pacific at top speed. The Aegis cruiser USS Port Royal, the Spruance-class guided missile destroyers USS Oldendorf and Callahan, the Oliver Hazard Perry-class guided missile frigate USS Ford, and the Los Angeles-class submarine USS Portsmouth SSN-707, made up this even more potent carrier battle group. This mighty American CBG sailed through the Taiwan Strait when Beijing declared a simulated amphibious strike. The PLA was powerless to stop the American warships that were close to its shoreline, 